In this video, I will show you how to add Discord to Roblox profile. So let's jump straight into it. So here we are, as you can see currently on Roblox. Now, if you come across to this menu on the left hand side, once you're logged into your account, you just want to go ahead and click onto profile. So at the moment, you can see I've currently not got my Discord showing on my profile. Now to do this, what you're going to want to do is open up a new internet tab come across to google.com and you want to search for the RoPro extension. Once you've done that, go ahead and click onto the link, which is going to be the Chrome Web Store link. So that's this one here. And what you want to do first is click the blue button to add RoPro to your Chrome, just like so. So as you can see, RoPro has now been added to Chrome. So what we can now do is come back to our Roblox and what you're going to want to do is refresh the page and you're going to see the RoPro icon up in the top right hand corner. So once you've added Roepro, what you're going to want to do next is come back to your home screen because you're first of all going to want to verify your account. So if you come back to the home screen, you're going to see an option in the top right hand corner which says verify Roepro user. So what you want to do is go ahead and click onto this and what you can do is verify your Roblox account in game. So you just want to click here and it's going to ask for an emoji verification code. So from here, what you're going to want to do, you don't want to click the play button. If you look to the right hand side of this bit of text, you've got a little Roblox button here. So if if you click onto this, this is actually going to open up the experience you need to play. So as you can see, it's called RoPro User Verification. So you want to click the green play button to load this through. Then what's going to happen, you'll be taken to a screen like this, where you can click the blue button to generate your verification code. So now what you need to do is just simply highlight these emojis and then hold down Ctrl and C to copy these emojis. Once you've done that, just come back to the verification screen, hold down Ctrl and press V or Command V if you're on a Mac. And then what that's going to do is verify your account. Now, once you've verified your account, what you want to do is come up to the top right hand corner and you're going to see the RoPro icon here. Just go ahead and give that a click to be taken to a screen like this. Now, from here, you need to link your Discord to your profile. So just to note, this is only available if you have a 13 plus account. You cannot do this on a child based account. What you want to do is basically copy your Discord username into the box here. So here we are, as you can see, I'm currently here on Discord. So what you're gonna to want to do is come down to the bottom left hand corner and click onto your profile name down here. And this is gonna be your username here that you want to copy. So you can see the button to copy username. Just go ahead and give that a click to copy it. Then you can go ahead and paste that into the box here. So once you've done that, be sure to click the blue save button. And we're gonna get this confirmation message which says updated your Discord. To remove your Discord, click the save when the input box is empty. So just go ahead and click okay. So once we've done that, we can now come back to our Roblox account, to our profile. And what we're gonna do is come to this menu on the left hand side, click onto profile. What it's going to do is load up our profile page and as you can see we've linked our discord here so that is how to add discord to roblox profile with that being said i hope this quick tutorial did help you out today and if this did help you out i would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel with that being said i just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and i will see you in the next video